that's that uh, that's that four by six band saw. Man, I made a lot of cuts with that blade right there. You know, that's one of them. Uh, that's one of them cheap blades right there. They say, you know, cuts pretty good for me. That's four pieces, eleven gauge square tubing. The well seam located over towards the corner. So. Uh, Five eighths round bar slip in there kind of easier than if the well was in the center. Sixteen inches long, eleven gauge square tubing, weld seam selected to be over towards the corner. Four by six band saw. You know, you know, get her done. Now the order, 20 pieces, 16 inches long, 11 gauge, square tubing, selected with the well seam over towards the corner. That's that four by six band saw. That one of them cheap old blades. Been using it all week. Seems to work pretty good. You know, I made literally hundreds of cuts with that blade. That and here in Middle Tennessee, the geographical center of something, shop dog sand, cutting up the square tubing. The order called for 20 pieces, 16 inches long, square tubing, 11 gauge, select with the well seam over towards the corner of the tube. Now we're going to get her done here on this, that's that four to six band saw. Uh, El Cheapo blade, if you know what I mean there. Bottom of the line, they say. I've done already made several hundred cuts with it. I'm okay with that. You know, the job to be done order 20 pieces square tubing 11 gauge select with the well seam toward the corner of the tube and i'm going to handle the job with this uh that's that four to six band saw uh, i got one of them cheap blades the last time i was up there at the store you know, I've done already made several hundred cuts with that blade right there. I'm okay with that.
we'll mark off four more. That old, I refer to it as being old. I've had this all a long time. I think about 1992 or somewhere back in there. Most that saw. Well, the blade that I've been telling you about that had so many cuts on it just now, it broke. That's a new blade on there right now that you're looking at. So, I was, I was happy with that blade that broke today. I got more cuts out of it, more accurate cuts, let's say, out of that blade. Ever, 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 that, that blade didn't make a bad cut. Um, as some do. So, blade tightness has, will change the angle on the pulley bolts, pulley wheel, guide wheel. Make your blade cuff in the middle. It's too tight. Just saying. Seems on that last blade, I hit that sweet spot. That's lasted forever. But long enough to where I took mental note of the fact that it could break mid saw job. Y'all remember in the playlist, that's that four by six band saw, the video. You know, I tuned it up one, I, one, one time I tuned that, that saw up right there, four by six. Uh, took it apart on the video. Uh, check it out. Recommend, if you don't have one of them saws, get one. Well, the way I look at it, you know, I'm over here to with this camera running off at the mouth now, but normally I would be on the other side of the shop doing something else. My whatever it is I need to be doing. But with the setup as you see here, just it is cut off automatically. A strap on it there to keep it from going all the way to the floor. You know, just let it saw. When you get done with the main project over there, you come back, I do, and reset it to size and all over again. Like an employee, you don't have to pay. You know, one of them evenings when you have to cook something, but you really don't have a taste, I guess you would say, a flavor. You know, other than the past two nights ago was that incident with that uh, 
that instant pudding you, you know you put you put this pudding mix in a container with two cups of milk you know you, you can mix up more than one at one time if you want to but other than that incident like today I ain't been to store in about a month you know as far as little snacks so you know I just now scored a that's one of them cokes in a can you know thinking you know well, 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 I don't have nothing at all laid back you know other than maybe fry some taters or something like that but you know how good does it get let's look in that mailbox uh, man you know what I don't know what country that's going to be from but I tell you what there's been a couple of them things right there that's been more than good you know so there's been a couple of them uh, one of them that comes to mind immediately is I'm not sure even what country that it was from you get a different country every month uh, John and Stacy done already hooked me up with these right here man that's one of them gifts that keeps on giving right there. You know, about one a month you get in your mailbox. Mm. Just saying.